these two apps, I think you should have them on your phone, um, especially your kids. Make sure your kids have them on their phone. These two, this app right here with the heart with the cross in the middle and also, and also this first A. I'm going to click the first one, with the heart, and just show you what it looked like. It's got CPR. Uh, it's got choking and everything. You can click on it. It actually show you a video on how to do it. So we're going to click on this CPR. And we're going to go with adult. If you witness an adult suddenly collapse, As you can see it's showing the video the on what to do. If there is no response, call 911. And this is a really, really good app. Next, uh, hope bear you don't the chest and push it, hard and fast uh, in the center of the chest. a good app to have on your phone. And as you see this Continue video, chest compressions like until help arrives. 30 seconds. Okay, I'm going to go back. And you can also look at how to do it on children and infants. So, and it also has videos. So we're going to go to the next app, the first aid. And you can do this in English or Spanish. Up here to the left hand side, you hit that. And you can pick what language you want it in. I'm going to just keep it on English. Hit done. And you scroll through. You see it got everything from bleeding, first aid on burns, choking, diabetics, everything. Uh, it's pretty good. It's a really good app here. And I'm going to click on this one that says alert uh, allergies. And it, you can walk through and read this stuff. It also has a couple of videos in here. Uh, the EpiPen. I'm going to look at it and I'm going to play this video here on the top. Hold the auto injector with the needle end perpendicular to step and near the outer thigh. Quickly and firmly do. push the tip straight into the outer thigh. You will hear a click indicating that the spring mechanism has been triggered. Hold the auto injector firmly in place for 10 seconds to deliver the medication. Then remove the auto injector from the thigh and massage or have the person massage the injection area. Okay, if this video helped, subscribe to my channel and make sure